Hi, I'm Steve Jones and I'm going to tell you how wind power is created. Now, wind power is exactly what it says. It is power from the wind. And most people seem to think that it has an infinite amount of energy. But of course, that is not true. In fact, there is rated by area the wind in watts per square meter. That is the amount of energy per square meter of ground you can get from the wind in a certain area. And this obviously will vary whether the wind is blowing or not. But there is a maximum amount you're going to get. And if you put too many windmills in that area, you will find that some of the windmills produce a lot of energy and some don't produce any. But the overall amount will be according to this formula on the uh, number of watts per square meter. So when wind power is created, it is mechanical energy. You have these, which are windmills, usually with three uh, sails. And these three sails rotate, and at the top of the pylon on which they stand, there is a generator. This produces electricity, which is collected underground on wires and goes to the grid. Now, this is a typical system for wind energy. In the past, wind power was used particularly in rural areas where there was no other kind of energy source. You would find them in the outback in Australia, in the backwoods in America, where there was nowhere you could get, for example, electricity. And this was an easy way of getting wind power. It was used to pump water, it was used to produce electricity. So, this is basically how wind power is created.